As our first uh, act of creativeness for Nutella Day, we've created Nutella Soda using Tarani Hazelnut Tarani Chocolate. And uh, would everyone like to take a sip, please? Insufficiently hazelnutty. Insufficiently hazelnutty. Insufficiently hazelnutty. Okay, we can we can spice that up for you. It has a good sophisticated chocolate hazelnut situation going on. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I can believe in this one. The carbonation is a little bit of an acidic note, I think, but mm -hmm. it maybe go that well with the chocolate. Hmm. Okay. So what I'm hearing is from two people, we need more hazelnut presence in this. Okay, so the first thing I tried was the, the Equal Exchange milk chocolate with a hint of hazelnut. Mm -hmm. And it did have just a hint of hazelnut. Otherwise, mm. it was, you know, just mostly milk chocolate, which is, you know, really not my favorite. Sure. And it's somewhere in the 30s for milk chocolate, 30%? Yeah. yeah. Now, the second thing I tried was the 60% dark chocolate green and blacks with uh, hazelnuts and dried currants. Um, and that is significantly superior. Mmm. Good so. to know. All right, thank you. All right, this is an Oreo that I split in two. There's a three quarter cream nice. and a one quarter cream. Uh, mm -hmm. On the one quarter cream, I put a blob of Nutella, and now I'm going to fit the creams back yeah, together here, so it should be a good fit here. There we go. And now we have, check this out, it's a double chocolate vanilla and hazelnut kind of Oreo. Mm. Let's see how that one works. Right, yeah. A lot, actually. It's good. It's good. They should do this. Okay. I think it's so right. That'll be the next round. Yeah. I think you guys should try this. Mm -hmm. So, you're trying Nutella directly on the cheese. On Monterey Jack, yeah. And it's a mild cheese, so it provides a good substrate for Nutella. Mm -hmm. And you're fine with how it came out? Oh, it's delicious. I have mixed some of the cake frost, non-cake frosting and hazelnut Nutella spread with Bailey's at the suggestion of Jack. Was that your suggestion? Bailey's Irish cream? And now I'm going to try it. Okay. It's like an in the hospital. Mm. Very good. You should, you should get in on this. Yeah. Uh, and I can confirm that if you take regular Nutella or honey Nutella, either one, and mix them with uh, cayenne, you don't have to go with a lot. Put a nut, try it, try it a little bit at a time. Cayenne makes a nice burn in here. It's a really good combination for when you get the nut and the chocolate all going. This one is the commercial Nutella. This one is, I think, the hot spicy. No, that's the homemade with Bailey's. Homemade that's with Bailey's Bailey. ice cream. This is. With Bailey's. So that's the, the homemade spicy, with, uh, and then this is the chunky organic. I see. So. <laughs> Just one bite. Well, that's the one I knew and loved from France. Mm -hmm. That's your. Well, the organic tastes very similar, but it is thicker. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and this one is maybe the hot one. Probably homemade with that. How hot is it? Not good. <laughs> Probably not hot enough for Sunny. It could definitely be hotter. Okay, so for her birthday, uh, we have the Nutella shot that we'll construct using creme de coco. In this case, light creme de coco. Equal parts with Frangelico, the hazelnut. Damn, so there we go. Uh, looks harmless. Tastes amazing. Okay. Happy birthday, Terry. I, I can't do it all at once. Just sample, sample and, and, and report back. Oh, it's good. Good. <laughs> yeah, I can drink more of it. Oh, this is going to be bad. <laughs> so, Sam, you now hold in your hand the Nutella cheesecake, which is basically Nutella, cream cheese, sugar, and a couple of flavorings. Oh. <laughs> Would you like to elaborate on that? <laughs> okay, it looks very creamy and mousse-like, and this is looking like a graham cracker crust to me. I am a fan of the graham cracker crust. Uh. I really don't care. Wow! What was the problem with the last time was... It's like Nutella-flavored chocolate mousse. Your team, not mm. you. Yeah. Ah. And that's good? That's a thumbs up? Yes, it is. Mm. What if I'm not really a pie person, mm -hmm. but this is mostly just pie form. If we had mm. gone and, uh, yeah, that works for me. So step us through what you've done here. <laughs> what we must do is separate the Oreo, put the cream on your finger, prepare the Oreo itself with the Mexican spiced Oreo Nutella filling, and then you have the Oreo mm -hmm. and finish with the cream. Mm.